Welcome to the best, most extreme, most intense competition ever. I'm your one and only host, Dee Dee. Ahem. And coffee. You do realize I'm the one who came up with this idea, right? You're just along for the ride. No need to give me that sass. Well, sorry for working on this building all night long while you had to go to the local casino. Some people. I didn't have to go to the local casino. I just didn't want to work. How did you even get this job? Ugh. You know what? I give up on this. I think it's good enough. Well, it's the thought that counts. Hey, you don't know what kind of crap I had to go through to get this building. Did you steal it? I, uh, well, it's not important. Even if I did pick up the building from Yoyo City and then take it to where we are now. By the by, where are the competitors who are just oh so desperate to compete? You'll see soon enough. Say, how about we check out this building? No, let's just stand here and talk the entire episode. Alrighty, let's go. That was a horrible idea. I kinda wanted to join him. Wow, this is so modern. Didn't expect you to be so up to date. What is that supposed to mean? You act and look like you're ancient. Why, you little... <laughs> <laughs> and you look like you'll need an eye patch, Captain. And you look like coffee. Wow, I am just so offended. Now let's just go. Or would you rather be taken kicking and screaming? I'll take kicking and screaming. Do it yourself. You'll never take me alive! This is the elimination area! Huh, I actually really like this. Wait, what's this gadget? Ooh, those. Those are the voting devices I bought. With? Your casino winning! See, you did help with making this! You're so mean! I hate you! That was my life's earnings! Gone! Well, there's a paycheck with your name on it if we get through this without another cancellation. All right, I'll stop complaining. This is a room. There's no point of this room being here. I just want this tour to go on as long as possible. Anyways. Here's a confessional booth, where the contestants can get everything off their chest. Can we use it? Of course. Allow me to demonstrate it to you. <clears throat> Dee Dee still plays with dolls. Wait, what? Where did you get that info? I didn't. I just took a guess. Oh, but I guess it's true now. Hmm. Well, let's take a look at the bedrooms, shall we? This is my favorite room. Check it out. Coffee, we don't have to check out your mother's basement. Not exactly what I meant. Uh, all the contestants have their own special bed determined by who they are. Why is this one wet? You'll see soon enough. Whoa! So many presents! Are they for me? Yup, all yours. <laughs> no! This show was supposed to be all about me! <laughs> oh, and of course you, Coffee. That's what I thought. Hey, check out this list. What's it supposed to be? A bunch of embarrassing secrets about you the producers gave me to motivate you. Mm, what? I'm not T. Oh, sorry, those are my secrets. Wait a minute, who made that list? Hee <laughs> hee, looks like you've been double crossed. Just whatever, let's go meet the contestants. No, it's all about me. So, I see the detectives are back with a new recruit. Yeah, we put Screw Up in charge of recruitment, but she fired herself accidentally. Luckily, we have a replacement. Hey, a uh, script. I believe you have to introduce yourself. Oh, but you have to check the script out, Exit. Anyways, my name is Script, and I'm an inspiring script writer. 
we should hire him to write the episodes of this show. Hey, no breaking the fourth wall. Remember what happened last time you did that? I do not want to bail you out again. Oh, looky here, a cute couple. Uh, what? I sure am glad I can be with the magical unicorn! <laughs> Fluffy unicorn! Well... I'm here to destroy everyone! Mark my words, for I am Cardmaster Spe- Hey, watch where you're going, you absolute moron! I mean, hello everyone, I'm Sushi. I hope to make a bunch of friends here, and sell my cereal! Buy some sushi flakes today! Yeah! Let me eat you instead. Hey, that's your sister, right? You gotta tell me about her. Oh, well... She's a nutcase. Didn't know you two were related. Didn't know you two were married! Didn't know a pirate would be a horse. <laughs> Say, what's with your friend down here? Oh, hey, uh, you, do you want some? You've got some serious issues. Aw, thanks. You too, Miss Coffee Lady. Hear that? He complimented you! You want two eye patches, matey? Uh, say, do you got any napkins? I love the texture of them. Go wild. I wouldn't tell him to go wild. Or he may, and he trashed the place. Oh my goodness, it's so very nice to meet you. And you are? A Wony Prisoner. Thanks for bailing me out. Oh, uh, I just wanted your name. I'm Hay Bale. The police are all over me. Ooh, got some fans, girl? D d did you just hear what she said five seconds ago? Well, I can't wait to make even more friends. You better hope none of these people secretly work for the CIA. Oh, I wouldn't worry about that. I just use an old trick I like to call, throw sin in their eyes and run away as quickly as I possibly can. Works every time. You wouldn't happen to have any spare sand with you. Oh, yes. Let me get my bottle of sand. Well, you didn't have to be sarcastic. What was that? Whoa, you were on TV once. Who are you again? Oh, yeah. That. <laughs> well, I'm Bowtie. Me and my partner in crime are pretty big in this business. So I'm here to school all these rookies. Oh, cool, yeah, yeah, just, I'll group you up with this fine lady. Um, hi, I'm Amber. Right. I see you've saved the best for last. You're not even the last? Say no more, boy. Your future president is speaking. Hmm. I'd like at least three more cameras every time I'm on screen as well. God, you're even more fame-hungry than Dee Dee. Also, I'm sorry, male? Oh, are you a feminist? You know, I got that impression when I first saw you. When I thought you were male. Now I totally see it, since you're female. Wow, totally not sexist. If you're not a feminist, then it must be hard for you to take all of this in. Huh? I know. I'm really good looking. Your fries look disgusting. You must not be all that bright. Sorry you were created that way. Your parents must have been horrified when they saw you. <laughs> First of all, I'm adopted. Second of all, how could I be horrified? I literally look like a coffee cup with a face. Well, why am I so attractive? Because you spend your entire life looking at a mirror because you can't get a real job. <laughs> what do you know? I'm a future president, and for your information, looking in the mirror is my job. I pay myself handsomely. And I'm an atheist pope, get lost. And I'm Squidward. Is this how this game works? Looks like these are our last two competitors. You two look like a riot. Oh, hi, Ole fans! I love you very much! Literally no one knows who you are yet. Correction! I'm a fan!
famous pop star. I came on this show to get some sponsors. That is, if you don't get out first, which would be hilarious. How about you? What's your name? Oh, I'm Poison. This is gonna be so awesome. Whoa! Glad to see you're so excited. Have any hobbies? Oh, well, I'm kind of normal. But honestly, who doesn't love playing with explosives nowadays? And that's all we got to hear from him today. Like, actually, check out the texture of this bomb. In fact... Oh, no. No, 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 no! Hey, boss, I had an idea to help make this company not fail. I don't need your advice. I'm vinyl. I'm epic. <laughs> but Mr. Vinyl, I promise you that the idea could change the world. Our company could explode. Dee Dee confiscated his luggage. <gasps> no, you can't use it. Well then. How's about we start competing? Since most of you guys literally know nothing about each other, I have a jar of secrets with pieces of paper. If you admit to the secret, you get a point. You can get a maximum of three points. Let us begin. Come on, people, gather around. So, when's the part when we lap dance? <gasps> Never. Don't worry, I'm always available. You couldn't see it, but I winked through my eye patch. Quite frankly, I don't blame Dee Dee for flirting with me. Unfortunately, I'm not Dee Dee's type. So, is everyone comfortable? No. Then we can begin. Just a heads up, if nobody admits to their secret, I'm taking a cookie from the cookie jar. For shame, coffee. For shame. Did you really have to blind us? Yes, now let's begin. I do not like quartz. Oh, you don't? Darn it, I was in the middle of making an erotic fanfiction between you both. No, that was a secret. Oh, so you do like quartz. No, I... Okay, I admit it. I'm sorry, Kors, but it just wasn't meant to be. Knowing her, she probably killed him. Next secret. I recently joined the job I'm currently in, thinking it was a fast food place. Alright, alright, so it was me. But can you blame a guy for wanting a simpler job? Well, on the subject of fast food, I host a fast food place full of diabetes. Wow. Sure wonder who that can be. I know, right? Some people are just the worst. Looks like the person this secret belonged to didn't admit it. Uh, usually if people didn't admit to a secret, I wouldn't reveal it. But god dang it, Ebaf, you make it way too obvious. Lies! I host a bodybuilding place. Yeah, your fast food place. I once dated a non-living cactus. Oh my, you have? He must have been sharp. Honestly, I can definitely tell you were the one who diddly darn dumped him. Cactuses are quite beautiful. So you did date a cactus. Well, why wouldn't I? We had a whole life ahead of us. We even had a little pet rat named Jeremiah. Oh, I missed the little thing. Just be glad we didn't get into the stage after marriage. Damn, that would have been nasty. Hey now, don't be a prick to that cactus. Anyways, I was the worst singer in my high school years and used medicine to make my voice sound better. Well, I have quite a beautiful singing voice. Watch. <laughs> Alright, that's one less person it could be. And you better run up fast. I'm dying for your cookies and I'm not afraid to eat them. <gasps> wow, that was so cool! Could you do that again? Hmm... She did it. He's right. I'm kind of surprised she admitted it. Most celebrities would play the blame game. So good on you. Ugh, <laughs> oh, that was so embarrassing. No matter though, 
I can now sing with or without my headset. <gasps> All right, princess, out of here. Ooh, let me read the next one. I like to be hugged when I feel upset. Oh, whoever it is, I'll give them a big hug. Whoever it is is probably a big wuss. <laughs> oh man. Double the wuss. I like to disguise as my lover and gloat about how sexy they are. That's seriously weird. Like, actually, whoever this is needs to go to a therapist. Oh, like, you never wanted to do this. Damn it. I used to do that. I'm not talking to you. I once set off fireworks in my toilet when it was clogged. Oh, this is me. Me. I still have the evidence. Let me go get him. You don't. And he's getting them. Well, I sleep in a toaster. <laughs> it's so comfy. <laughs> you just kind of squash your body and kind of slide yourself through the slot, you know? Glad you like my toaster. I love the toaster. Wow, Mochi, nice job running a secret. A friend of mine found me in their garbage and lives with them since. Oh, yeah. That was very nice garbage. There was some nice spaghetti in there. Well, you do look like garbage. I'll have you know that I'm very insulted. I look like trash, not garbage for your information. I secretly take 25% of my employer's earnings and spend it on cookies for the cookie jar. Okay, I get it. I lie a lot, but that was not me. It was the fat man! Jeez, you guys are worse at hiding secrets than DDs that existing. Okay, since exit signs didn't own up, I'm not only taking one of the cookies from you all, but also from the cookies exit sign bot. No! -ho -ho! Calm yourself, it's not that bad. I guess you're right. Ahem. No. That's better. I used to be called a different name back in the day, however I changed my name by doing something objectively weird. Guilty. I was originally just a blank sheet of paper at a young age, but I wanted to be something more. So I wrote on myself, which sounds weird, I know, and now I'm known as Script. Hmm, according to all my Careful, that's private. Well that was... something. I got into a quarrel with one of the other contestants on the show. Yes, me! Listen to me, see me, hear me, notice me! This yellow diamond attacked me! Okay, you know what? This is getting tiring. Montage time! I said montage, but keep going. Alright. <sighs> Last question. I drugged the host while they were reading this. I feel funny. Hey! She read my three secrets! Yeah, and you didn't answer any of them. Oh, I know this one! Sushi, please, you don't even know what draw. It was the vegan girl. Excuse me? You're messed up, and that's coming from me. But I didn't. Oh yeah? Then why is one of your secrets? I published parts of a diary from one particular member of our detective guild. Only screwed up people would do that. But it was screw up. Besides, at least I didn't go abandon my family to live with some strangers. At least I didn't hire Eva for my job, and then bribed him to leave once he became a dictator. Well, at least I wasn't a sellout to his commercials. At least I'm hot! I'm just yelling because I feel like it! Uh, can I get some more crayons? I don't know why everyone's blaming Tofu for drugging us. I could tell it was sushi. If the drugs aren't enough, sushi literally shrinks people and plays with them like dolls. She's a psycho! All I wanted were some crayons, that's not too much to ask for. Ow, Everybody, that? calm down. Whoa, boss is down. I was promised free XP. Did I hear you say boss? Oh, sushi. That's boss to you. Uh, boss, why is the other boss on the floor? Because the vegan girl drugged her! She did? She'd be a wonderful recruit to our party. You idiot. Can I get those crayons now? 
Well, since Sushi drugged us, I'm letting everyone else win the reward. Please, I'm already a reward. You're lucky I even auditioned to be here. And you just lost your reward. Can the reward be a restraining order from all of these weirdos? Well, at least I'm not one. Please hit me hard enough so I never wake up. Maybe you should get on my nerves. Anyways, you guys will be going to the pool in the building next to this one, and we'll be watching a movie along with it. Not water? Nah! Well, now I'm glad I didn't win the reward. Because you can't swim? Or because you'll sink to the bottom? No comment. Maybe you should give him the reward back. It would be humorous. No way! Why? Because they're cleaning up the mess you guys made here, you pigs! Hey! I'm only 0.1% beef. And I'm 99.9% .9 pissed off! Ugh, I hate everyone! Aw, I love you too, sweetie. Oh, uh, looks like she's going to her room. Anyways, will coffee survive with these two here? Probably not. Find out next time on Total Drama Action Arena! Sell out. Two to the one to the one to the three. I pay myself handsomely. You're talking to the future president. Oh, are you a feminist? Two to the one to the one to the three. You're messed up and that's coming from me. I know, I'm hot. At least I'm hot. I see you've saved the best for last. Trust me, there's more to come. So when's the part when we lap dance? Good thing I don't get that reward. I, I don't blame Adobe for flirting with me. I'd like at least three more cameras every time I'm on screen as well. Sorry you were created that way. Your parents must have been horrified when they saw you. <laughs>
Magical unicorn! 